Caitlin Ogle and Etowah, where they're performing rescues. Caitlin? That's right. And I want you to look. This is a mess right here at 180th and Pine. Will's going to show you. And just behind me, look, that big transformer. We're working with very little light out here. That big transformer is just hanging by the wires. And then look over there. You can see the wires dangling from the power pole. And that car over there, I'm told by a nearby firefighter that a family member in that car was just rescued from their storm shelter. And the reason why this whole area has been a mess because of that transformer, yes, but up there on Cedar Road, it is covered with downed trees so people can't get by. They've been stopping people and people keep asking, how am I supposed to get home? And they're just like, we don't know right now. We're trying to get through. And I saw some Oklahoma City police out here and I thought they were just helping. And the fire department said, no, they're actually here to help rescue one of their buddies who was trapped in a storm shelter. So right now they're trying to get those trees out of the way so people can drive down that road and get to town. But right now there's no clear path to Etowah. So we're going to try our best and get some more information. Back to you. Caitlin, stay safe out there. Etowah, small town near Needmore, uh, Cleveland, Pottawatomie County line basically is where Caitlin Ogle is.